This is the Sony Walkman NWZ WT52 music player. It's a 2GB player with space for around 500 tracks. Now it's a little bit different from most MP3 players because the headphones are built into the player. Simply take them apart and pop them in your ears. Now the outward facing case is waterproof and this is a good news if you get caught in the rain. It's not actually meant to be used immersed in waters and that's because the earbuds themselves aren't waterproof. But it's not a problem to wash the player so long as it's dry according to the instructions before use. The controls are well designed and there are several ways that it makes up for not having a display. There were audio cues describing the current mode, but far more importantly the buttons have been sensibly laid out. For example the volume buttons are different heights, so you don't have to learn or guess which one makes the volume go up, it's simply the bigger button. The jog switch not only moves between tracks but between folders, which is handy if you prefer to listen to albums. The other aid to navigation is zapping. This mode skims through the music on the player, playing a 4 second clip at a time. What makes Zappin different is that it chooses a 4 second clip that it thinks is recognisable, rather than the beginning of the track. It can also play 15 second clips if you want more time to make a decision. Now if you're looking for a power switch, there isn't one. The player turns on automatically when the two halves are separated, and then turns off again when they snap back together again. And there's a small magnet that just about holds them in place. There's a plastic clip provided to make sure that the player doesn't separate and turn on accidentally in a pocket or a bag. Other accessories include a desktop stand and we were pleased to see that it uses mini USB to connect to the computer rather than a proprietary table, so you're not limited to using the stand. As everything is built into one piece, you won't be able to substitute your own headphones. Thankfully this isn't a problem as I felt the headphones are good and faithfully reproduced a variety of music styles from Jimi Hendrix to Bach. The Sony NWZ W252 costs £50, that's about the same price as an iPod Shuffle, and also comes in black and pink as well as the white we have here.